In this video, we are going to look at how to make an exact copy of one hard drive to another using the Drive to Drive feature in Drive Image XML. A Drive to Drive copy is an exact duplicate of the original hard drive. If the original hard drive fails, the new one can replace it and work right away. The hassle of having to restore your data is eliminated. To open Drive Image XML in Windows 7, click the Start button. Hover over All Programs, click the Runtime Software folder, and then click Drive Image XML. If you're using Windows 8.1, go to the Metro screen and type Drive Image XML. Before you finish typing, the program should appear on the list below the search bar. Click Drive Image XML from the list of results. If the User Account Control window appears, click Yes to continue. The welcome screen will now appear. One of the options that appear on the bottom left is Drive to Drive. The Drive to Drive feature can work in two different ways. First, you can overwrite the entire contents of the destination drive so that it is an exact duplicate of the source drive. The destination drive must be at least as large as the source drive for this to work. Second, if the destination drive is larger than the source drive, you may be able to create a partition on the destination drive so that the existing data is not erased. The second option is a bit advanced and will not be covered in this video. We will focus on the first option of copying the contents of one hard drive to another hard drive, overwriting the contents of the destination drive in the process. Click Drive to Drive to begin. At the top of the window, you will be prompted to select one drive to copy to another drive. In this example, we will select the C drive, which is the usual drive name of the primary hard drive. Click Next to continue. A new window will appear. Leave the default options as is, and click Next. A list of options will now appear asking you to pick the destination drive or the hard drive you will be copying to. Looking at the table, Disk 0, number 1, will be the hard drive we are backing up, or the source drive. Note that in this example, the capacity is 33 gigabytes. Unless you have multiple partitions, there should only be one other option for the destination drive. Under Drive Number Partition, it should be labeled Disk 1 Number 1, and given the logical drive name of E, or something other than C. Choose the destination drive by clicking on it. In this example, we will choose disk 1 number 1. Note that the capacity of this drive is 596 gigabytes. As mentioned, the destination drive must be at least as large as the source drive for this to work. After choosing the destination drive, click Next to continue. A verification screen will now appear showing copy from this drive and to this destination. If everything looks correct, click Next. The Drive to Drive copy will now begin. If a message appears stating that the destination drive cannot be locked, click Retry. If the same message reappears, click Ignore. A final confirmation window will prompt you to type in the drive name, such as Disk 1 Number 1, and click OK. Note that you do not have to type the drive name in all caps. Type in the drive name and click OK. The confirmation window will disappear and the progress window will show a progress bar at the bottom along with time passed and time remaining. The process may take several hours depending on the size of the hard drives. Once finished, a message should state Drive to Drive for C completed successfully, where C is the letter designation of the source drive. Click Finish to exit the Drive to Drive copy window. Should you need to boot from the new hard drive, the help files in Drive Image XML will instruct you on how to do that. In this video, we reviewed how to make an exact copy of one hard drive to another using the Drive to Drive feature in Drive Image XML. The show notes for this video are available by clicking the link below the video. Please help to support HelpfulVideoTips.com by subscribing to this YouTube channel and visiting HelpfulVideoTips.com to follow along on social media. I'm Tom Sutton. Thank you for watching.